Hello, welcome to English for Everyone, where we practice real life American English. Today we're learning some very important vocabulary, so let's get started. What happened? He dropped the plate. He dropped the plate of spaghetti on the floor. And he's always dropping things. He's always having accidents like this. So I describe him and I say he's clumsy. Clumsy is an adjective. It describes a person who has a lot of accidents. And he is clumsy. Pronunciation. The U is short. It makes the uh sound like cup and up, cl, clum, z. The S makes a Z sound like zebra. Clums, clumsy. And the last sound is a long E like green beans. Clumsy, clumsy. The stress is on the first syllable. Clumsy. He's really clumsy. He's always dropping things. Let's practice. Is he clumsy? That's right. He's really clumsy. He's always dropping things. What happened? She put her foot in the trash can. She stepped in the trash can. It was an accident, but she's always having accidents like this. So I can say she's clumsy. Clumsy is an adjective. Or I can say she's a klutz. A klutz is a person. It's one person, so we say a uh for one. She's a klutz. Pronunciation. Kl, kl. The U is short. It makes a sound uh like cup and up. Kl, tss. The Z is not pronounced with the voiced Z sound. It's pronounced with the S sound with no voice. Klutz, s, klutz. She's a klutz. She's always having accidents like this. If I want to give emphasis, I can use such. She's such a klutz. She's always having accidents like this. Stepping into trash cans and dropping things. She's such a klutz. Let's practice. Is she a klutz? That's right. She's such a klutz. These two people are always having accidents. They're always dropping things, stepping into trash cans. So I can say they are clumsy. You could say they are a couple of klutzes, but for two people, it's better to use the adjective clumsy. They are really clumsy. Let's practice. Are they clumsy? That's right. They are really clumsy. So remember, clumsy is an adjective. And klutz is a person. Make sure you use a, a klutz. So you can say he is clumsy or he is a klutz. It's the same idea. Thank you for watching. And if you like this video, subscribe to our channel. And if you want to become a member, click the join button. And we'll see you next time.